Well, Bastia had come off a very good week, a first away win in their rearranged match with Toulouse, added to the fact they had gained three extra points after Nantes were punished for fielding an ineligible player in their opening tie in Ligue 1. But Monaco were looking to respond to Paris Saint-Germain's Friday night win and close the gap back to five. It was Emmanuel Riviere who almost gave them the perfect start. But an excellent save from Jean-Louis Leca. Still no goals in February for the striker. Stuck on nine. But it was almost a terrific chance for Bastia to take the lead. But Francois-Joseph Modesto failing to score at the back post. Well, the game turned just before the break. Sebastian Scalacci scything down James Rodriguez. And the Colombian would bring the perfect repost with a terrific free kick. And that his first league goal in 2014, giving the keeper no chance. 1-0. It was at the break to Monaco. Well, a slender advantage for the visitors after scoring just before the break. Claudio Ranieri looking nervous as Gibrio Sisse, though, didn't last the 90. He looked surprised as he was subbed for Wabi Kazi. Sisse got his first league goal since returning to France in the match with Toulouse in midweek. It was Bastia who almost got back in the match by Sambu Yatebari. But his header going wide. And it was from another Bastia attack that eventually Monaco would break and get their second of the match. Brilliant from Valier Germain. And it came to James Rodriguez. He had acres of space to run into. He decided to take it himself. And a fantastic finish from the Colombian. And that his first brace in French football. Got his head down, finding the inside of the post. Well, Bastia still trying to get back into this with Riyad Bouzabou. Striking from distance, but tipped over comfortably by Danigel Subasic. And that was the end of proceedings. A slight disagreement between the players at the end, but no disagreement with the scoreline. 2-0 to Monaco. Five points now behind Paris Saint-Germain.